East Rutherford, New Jersey. Back up. Back up. Sergey, back up. Are you ready? Are you ready? Let's fight. Aratonov is two and one against tournament participants, splitting two meetings with Alistair Overeem. Arlovsky one and three. And his win comes against Fabrizio Verdun. Arlovsky starting fast. Starting fast and punching first. That's what you said. And moving. Right? You're not just standing there like they did with Rogers. He wants to get away from the cage. He's got to circle out and get out of there. Triple uppercut by Arlovsky. Nice steady diet of those uppercuts from Arlovsky. Heratonov was real good and close. He's a real good tight brawler. I know you said that Arlovsky is better boxing than Karatana, but I wonder technically if that's the case. Having seen what I've seen in Japan out of Karatana. Well, I think Karatana is, is a brawler boxer, but, but when you talk about classic boxing, Arlovsky is just crisp, clean, straight. They turn over, they're, they're just beautiful. He's got the better foot movement early on. Yes, he does. Tight guard by Karatana. Very patient. Karatana's coming with power. He, he, he's, he's gonna, as soon as that jab touches, he's going to fire that right hand up. Good counter left jab hook there by Arlovsky. Again, Arlovsky needs to get away from that cage. He's getting caught up in that cage. We talk about their respective knockout power. Arlovsky has three wins via submission. Karatanov has eight victories via submission. Raising left hook by Arlovsky. Arlovsky's looking good head movement. Karatanov, a man after my own heart, has played the accordion for many years. He hopes to fold up Arlovsky like an accordion as they are into a, some dirty boxing here. Oh, nice long range uppercut from Arlovsky. That punch will go right through the hands of Karatanov. Nice counter striking by Karatanov. Uh -oh. Beautiful right hand. And that would hurt him. Karatanov, he got another one through. Arlovsky trying to hold on now. There's a knee by oh. Karatanov. A looping right hand. Karatanov. Oh, he knocks Arlovsky down. Karatanov trying to finish that it. Is, oh, he does. It's over. Karatanov treating Arlovsky like Christina Aguilera treated the national anthem. From my last Sunday Super Bowl, oh. that's four consecutive losses for Arlovsky via form of knockout. And what did we say about Sergei Karatanov? And Arlovsky is still down, folks. Karatanov celebrating on top of the cage. And Josh Barnett predicted it would end quickly. Brett Rogers, could he face this man next if he can get through his first fight? That's the 17th first round of victory for Sergei Karatanov and the glassy-eyed Andrei Lovsky. And it's far be it for many of us, Gus, Frank, to talk about a fighter's career, what he should do. Frank, this is now four straight losses via form of knockout. Where does Arlovsky go from here? Well, I mean, I just, you know, your brain is not meant to take that much damage. It shouldn't be turned off that many times. And maybe it's time to give it up. I don't know. He looked great. He was focused. He was in there. And then he just... It didn't work out for him. Karatanov's ninth career win via form of knockout. And like I said, I remember when he debuted in Pride back in 2003, came, and uh, really, the dark horse may not be that dark, my friends. Uh, the Russian mercenary now showing sportsmanship and tending to Andrei Arlovsky, making sure he's all right, Frank. This was this the problem. He got caught up on the cage, and that leaping left hook caught him on the chin. He was a little bit wobbly already, and then it just took, bam, those two. Uh, he was already done. Karatanov gave him one more just in case. He didn't get up, but I, I think he got hurt. In the early exchanges, I think he got hurt, and he just wasn't recovering well. And when he was backing up, he had his hands down. That's what he did with Rogers. He backed up with his hands down, and he just caught it right on the chin. 
just no recovery from that left hook on. There was no recovery. Sergey Karatanov. Yes, there is the iron fist from Russia, and that fist may very well serve him incredibly well in this tournament. He is the first, of course, to advance to the semifinals. Sergey Karatanov, a heavyweight to watch in Strike Force. All right, here are the power strikes landed in the fight. Look at that number, 22 of 32 for Karatanov, just 8 of 22 for Arlovsky. Here once again is Jimmy Lennon Jr. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a time of two minutes, 49 seconds of round number one. He is the winner by way of knockout, continuing to the semifinals of the Strikeforce Heavyweight World Grand Prix. Leos Thompson, Sarah.